Today we'll be simplifying the expression 1 over x squared plus 5x plus 6 plus 1 over x squared plus 3x plus 2 divided by x squared minus 1 over x squared plus 2x plus 1. Our first step is to factor these trinomials and we'll start with the 1 in the first term of the numerator. The factors of 6 that add to make 5 are positive 3 and positive 2. Then the factors of 2 that add to make 3 are positive 2 and positive 1. In the denominator here, this x squared minus 1 is the difference of squares, so we can factor that as x plus 1 and x minus 1. And the factors of 1 that add to make 2 are positive 1 and positive 1. Now in the numerator, we want to combine these terms, so we need to get a common denominator. That first term is missing a factor of x plus 1, so we're going to multiply the top and bottom by x plus 1. On the other term, we're missing a factor of x plus 3, so we'll multiply the top and bottom by x plus 3. Now we get x plus 1 over x plus 1 times x plus 2 times x plus 3 plus x plus 3 over x plus 1 times x plus 2 times x plus 3. And in this step, our denominator will stay the same. We have x plus 1 times x minus 1 over x plus 1 times x plus 1. Now we can combine terms in the numerator. The x plus x gives us a 2x, and the 1 plus 3 gives us a 4. So we get 2x plus 4 on the top, and then our factors x plus 1, x plus 2, and x plus 3 in the denominator. That's divided by x plus 1 times x minus 1 over x plus 1 times x plus 1. Now we have a fraction divided by a fraction, so we have to multiply by the reciprocal. First, this numerator can be written as 2 times x plus 2. So this numerator here is going to stay the same. The division turns into multiplication, and then we take the reciprocal. So we have x plus 1 times x plus 1 over x plus 1 times x minus 1. Now we can start to cancel out factors. We see two x plus 1s in the denominator and in the numerator. There's also an x plus 2 in the denominator and the numerator. So what's left is a 2 and a factor of x plus 3 and x minus 1 in the denominator. So this is one way that we can write our answer. Or we could also distribute the denominator. So we could write it as 2 over x squared plus 2x minus 3. 